Subscribe to this channel and press the bell icon to get notified for the latest tech videos. Hey what's up YouTube this is Wasi here and today in this video I'm going to show you how you can connect your LinkedIn page to Google Data Studio or now which is called Local Studio so that you can have custom visualizations of your LinkedIn page. I'm going to show you how to connect your LinkedIn page to Data Studio for free not the LinkedIn ads. So here you can see I have a custom uh, report of some XYZ page of LinkedIn and here I can see all the data on Data Studio and I can easily share it with my other team members as well. So this is the best thing of having Data Studio connected to LinkedIn. Let's begin the video. First of all on Google you need to type Data Hub Gladiator. Basically this is a connector to connect LinkedIn to Data Studio. Here you can see the so you need to log in or sign up. If I go to pricing you can see that you have a free version and a pro version and an agency version. If I go to the free version you can see it is available for all data sources. Users will be one not multiple users. You can have free data studio templates. It's for personal use. It supports data studio which we want and you can have single data set and that's it. So if you're onto it then the free version is best and if i go to the data sources you can see that it is for linkedin insights or for linkedin ads so these are the connectors they have which we want to use you're just simply going to make a free account by entering your email and password the email and password are not necessary to be the linkedin ones as you're going to connect with linkedin later once your account has been made it's going to show your workspace here you can see uh, your Google name or some other name. It's again free to use all your data sources in one place uh, Templates of data sources, but you can make custom ones and the main thing is data integrity So only you have access to your personal space and other people can view it if you share it on your own So that's the reason why I like this one because it's free and it's secure here It's going to show you your personal workspace basically you have a workspace and in that workspace you're going to have your data so we're going to press on our name here you can see it's currently says no data sources found we need to connect linkedin so we're going to press on the create button on the top right side here you can see you can connect with these different social media platforms like facebook and instagram so in this way you can have all of your different data from your social media into one uh, single report or on multiple reports but it's going to make much easier for analyzing your pages so in my case i'm going to select linkedin company because i want to get the analytics of my linkedin page if you're on to ads you're going to select the ads option in my case it's going to be linkedin company no credentials found for linkedin company so basically now we're going to connect linkedin to this data studio connector so it can fetch data from it we're going to press on add credential and now here you're going to enter the email and password to log in to your LinkedIn account on which you want to get the data. Once you have logged into your LinkedIn account and given the authorization, it's going to show your LinkedIn account name. So now we're going to select our LinkedIn account in which we have our LinkedIn page. So it should automatically detect the page. If I press on this drop down menu, it's showing my page XYZ International. If you have multiple pages then you can select the one that you want to add so after that we're going to press on create and now it's going to actually connect uh, our LinkedIn data so that we can use it in data studio once it is connected as you can see it's showing right here you're going to press on these three dots you're going to press on looker studio so basically local studio or the old name was data studio you can use their base template or you can make a new report for new report you're going to have more flexibility in which which things you want and whatnot but for this video i'm just going to go with base template as i'm showing you how to connect data and not showing you how you can make each particular custom graphs so again it's going to go to the select connector page by default and you need to give authorization to uh, LinkedIn and uh, or your data studio first of all choose a data source we're going to select the page name again you can see it's showing right here the LinkedIn page name that we want to connect after that uh, use report template for new reports I'm just going to unselect this one press on connect 
here it's going to show you all the I would say columns of your data from LinkedIn as you can see right here their data type their default aggregation which you can change in the future as well if you want to or if you want to make some other custom fields with these ones you can also do that the best thing is that they also have their description as well so you know best what is going on so once you have seen all the data you're just simply going to press on create report here you can see you are about to add the data to this report so here is the data set we're going to press on add to report here it's going to make our report so here on the left side you're going to have your data set which is linkedin company along with all the tables and fields so let me just create a simple pie chart to show you that it is working i'm going to go to insert select a pie chart make a big one so you can see it quite easily again you can change all of these things so i'm going to select company size as a dimension and for the metric i want to select how many visitors were there i'm just going to just sum these values and i'm going to put them in descending order so it is going to take a little bit time because it is a third party connector and you can see for this xyz uh, linkedin page almost 35 percent of the visitors were on a company which had 51 to 200 employees so that's some really insightful data which on linkedin you can get but again you need to scroll to different pages but in this way i can add all of those needed graphs into one single report which can update over time is free and is easier for other team members to view and have a good look on the data so yeah guys in this way you can connect linkedin to uh, data studio or looker studio if you guys like this video like share subscribe if you have any other questions regarding this video write them in the comment section below and if you have subscribed to my channel please do so other than that thank you for watching and as always stay safe